Okay, so we're probably gonna get another quest right here since this is the place where it keeps sparking up every time. That was weird. Luckily, we're in Daggerfall now. So... The Mages Guild. I know exactly where that's at. It's literally right in the center of town, next to the Fighters Guild. Coincidental, co coincidentally enough. Well, so much for that. I was trying to jump over it, but... Guess not. Whoa, that scared me. The Thunder. Should be right here. Yep, this is it right here. Um, somewhere around here. Abner Tharn? Ah, excellent. You got my message. Apparently, that little creature isn't completely useless. Banekin can be such children. I hope you've nothing pressing. We could be here a while. Why are you dressed like that? I can't be strutting around <coughs> the city wearing my imperial regalia, can I? Your concern about my fashion is touching but irrelevant. I've called you here for a reason. If we are to determine a course of action, we need more information. What are you talking about? By now, it should be clear your prophet emperor brought these catastrophic events upon us. Everything that transpired is his fault. Menemarco deceived him. It wasn't his fault. Granted, Menemarco can be very persuasive and charismatic when he wants to be. We all believed him when he said we could change Varen's bloodline with the Amulet of Kings. Then why do you blame Varen? You saved Varen's life when you rescued him in Cold Heart. In return, he lied to you about his true identity and his part in causing the soul burst. He manipulated you from the very start. This, this Perhaps true. the question is, why don't you blame Varen? That is a very valid point. We saved him from Cold Harbor and yet he still had the audacity to lie to, lie to us. Abner Thorn may be a dick, but at least he's honest, right? Even though he did kind of manipulate us by insinuating that he knew where uh, Sai Sahan was, but he, in fact, didn't. But okay, moving on. Looks like everyone in this game likes to lie to us. Just tell me why you called me here. <clears throat> Varen wants to assemble a new group of companions in the vein of the original five. Claims it fulfills a prophecy in those wretched scrolls of his. Superstitious nonsense, but he is quite correct on one point. We need to find Sai Sahan. Why is Sai Sahan so important? In the chaos following the soul burst, Sahan stole the Amulet of Kings and fled the Imperial City. We're going to need that relic, and he is the only one who knows its current location. Where is Sai Sahan now? He was captured by Minimarco's agents and taken to an undisclosed location. We need to find out where he's being held. So what do you need me to do then? I'm down for anything. Minimarco keeps his most secret documents at Norbo, a hidden lair of Daedric cultists in the Stormhaven countryside. We must travel there and search for clues. I mean, I'll set out. Uh, I'll set out at once and meet you there. So we're, we're going to Stormhaven. Go to Stormhaven's eastern reaches and look for the Norvalk ruins. I will be waiting for you inside. Okay, thank you. I have some questions, though. If I can endure Titanborn's inane prattle, I can survive your assuredly erudite elucidations. Proceed. <laughs> All right. Uh, tell me about yourself. Well, if you must pry, I am Chancellor to the Elder Council and Overlord of Nibbane. But of all my titles, the greatest is my family name. Thun. Darn. We are the greatest of the noble houses with seats at the Imperial Court for countless centuries. A family of politicians? Politicians? A grossly <clears throat> inadequate word to describe our duties and our legacy. The Tharns have a storied history of advising kings and emperors that can be traced back to the first era. We understand the ebb.
So he's still here. Travel to Stormhaven. If I can endure. Uh, let me see if I can. Must pry. Politicians. A gross Where were we? Inadequate word to describe our duties and our legacy. The Tharns have a storied history of advising kings and emperors that can be traced back to the first era. We understand the ebb and flow of power. So, what will happen to you now? Ah, there's the rub. With my untimely defection, my family will likely be divested of its holdings. The name Tharn is probably being stricken from every document in the Imperial Archives as we speak. I detest being on the wrong side of history. Have you really lost everything? Don't sound so smug about it. This is a setback, nothing more. By allying with you, I will liberate the Empire from Menemarko's grip. The Empire is all that matters to me. I will do what I must to ensure its survival. I mean, I'll give it to him. He's very patriotic, if you will. Uh, is it your daughter, the Empress Regent, though? Clivia, she is comfortably lodged in Manamarco's pocket, along with my nephew Javard. I doubt they've given my disappearance a second thought. Ah, fair Clivia. My charming girl grew to be a ruthlessly ambitious woman. I taught her well. <laughs> Even if. That means that you're absent from her life? Okay. We got a lot of uh, good information from him in terms of who he is. Have I been to Stormhaven with this character? I have. So, let's go to the... Uh, Way Shrine so we can pop smoke. Is he pickpocketing? I think he's pickpocketing. You're in trouble now, pickpocket. <laughs> he got caught. That was funny. Okay, let's see. Stormhaven, here we go. Luckily, since I've been there, I could just fast travel there, no problem. They did say way rest, right? I think they said way rest. Believe he said Wayrest. I don't know. Let me see. Norvuk ruins. Where are the Norvuk ruins? It's all the way up north. This is the closest way shrine there, anyways. So although it's not exactly where I needed to be, it's still the closest that I could have fast traveled. I don't know why I came here before though. Let me see. Why have I been here before? Maybe I probably Found a way to come here so that I could probably buy some gear or something. I can't remember exactly. But I haven't touched any missions or quests that I haven't done on the channel yet. So the only thing I've done is a couple of dungeons, but I avoided the quests. Because at some point, I'm probably going to team up with some of you guys. If you guys want to, uh, at a later point, And then we'll tackle the story together. And also... Uh, I did a lot of dolmen grinding in Alkir Desert. Other than that, that's basically all I did. Let's get on our horse. Or Guar. Yeah. This character is awesome. I really am enjoying it. <clears throat> okay. I kind of want a different mount though. I just don't know what I want. These are my horses. Um. Battlefield scouts. Don't want a cat. We already have a bipedal. Don't want a camel. Don't want these guys. This one might be cool. Let me see. Let's try this one. Not 
Not really. <laughs> um, I don't really have anything good. Maybe this one, perhaps. Let's just stick with this one. Sure, why not? It kind of matches anyways a little bit. This one and the one that I had originally were probably the closest things that match with my character, but... Not exactly. Not not perfect. I think we're... I think we're almost done with the main story, too. Maybe a little bit over halfway, perhaps? It kind of feels like it's flying. It's a good thing. There's a dolman going on. We should... We should do it. Wait, can I can't even get there. I have to go around. Hold up. Can I get there before it's done? Probably not, but I'm going to try anyways. I don't think I'm going to make it. This mount is super slow. Oh god, come on. This uh, this has to be the entrance. I'm here, guys. Watch there not even be anybody here fighting. Alright. There is people here. Come on, give me one. Alright, good. Now I can get the XP. We got the tail end of this, but it's okay. Kamehameha! I definitely butchered that, by the way. Don't worry, fellas. I'll do all of these. Last one. Your soul is mine. I own. Come, let us play. Your brother's soul is mine. Okay, yep. They're all getting finished up. Dunzo! Let's see what cool things we get from this chest. Probably everything we already have. Yeah, we already have all of this stuff. And everything else is not important. Kind of funny that I still have the shackle breaker stuff in my inventory. I wasn't a hundred percent sure if I wanted shackle breaker or twice born, so I just kind of went with twice born. I'm pretty sure she's in the same quest, or maybe she just wants to do the delve. We're gonna do the delve while we're in here. That means we're gonna tackle the boss and everything. It must be a relief not to have Titanborn following you around like a lost puppy. He is such a dick. Is he here with us? He is. Alright. Where are we going? There's literally no one in here. Kamehameha! You guys literally don't stand a chance, man. I may not be the strongest character in the world, but... Definitely a hell of a lot stronger than them. You know what? First things first, I want to grab this, uh... I want to grab this thing over here. Got no power left. Use a potion. I noticed. Bastion, thank you. You guys want some too? You know what? You guys get the mighty Dawnbreaker. Sick. Dunzo. What went to 45? Not sure. Something went to 45, though. Weapon, maybe? 
Armor? Medium armor went to 45. I still need to put some skill points in there. Um. I think I'm gonna hold off because I still need to put one in here. Okay. I'm gonna hold off on the skill points for now. Oh, wait, hold on. I think that that female character person was, uh, waiting on me. She's gonna have to wait a little longer because I have a quest to do. Hey, that's Sai! Sahan is alive and he has not been broken. An important piece of the puzzle to be sure, but where is he being kept? You tell me. That was the deal. Me save you, you tell me things, remember? So far the 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 deal was me save you, you tell me nothing. Chimnel Adabar, the amulet of the kings of glory. An artifact of the Divines, a badge of office for the ruling emperors of Cyrodiil, and the key to my ascendancy. Yet it eludes me. Exploiting its power to bring about the calamity of our age was intoxicating. It made me aware of the limitless possibilities available to one strong enough and fearless enough to use it to achieve his own ends. The amulet has the power to create or destroy. But it also has the power to undo the damage caused by the soul burst, to mend the tear in the barrier between Nern and Oblivion. I must recover it before some fool fixes that which must remain broken. He knows of our plan to use the amulet to set things right. We must rescue Sai Sahan before he can be broken. Man, that means the Amulet of Kings is a lot more powerful than I thought. What's up, buddy? I'm way too strong for these guys. I really am. What? He shot at the rat, not this, not this Daedra. No. Okay. I gotta read these books. Nice try there, buddy. Dunzo. Bookshelf. I got enchanting. Get out of my way, Abner. I got some books to read. Woodworking. Dude, there's a ton of books here. Oh! Oh, I didn't see you. Ow! That's, that's enough. Enchanting again. I, I guess I'm not going to be getting a ton of uh, combat related skills from the bookshelves because I already got most of them maxed. Okay. Nobody here. Is this the boss? Let me see. It is. Come on. He's dead. He did not stand a chance. He was not that strong. And I completed the ruins. The delve. Cannot be overcome with standard interrogation techniques. Physical tortures appear to be useless. I have therefore instructed the Daedra to move Sai Sahan into the Halls of Torment. The Duchess will be most pleased to have a new guest. 
His flesh is strong, but perhaps the tortures of the mind will break him. I have come too far to allow this upstart swordmaster to thwart my plans. I will find the amulet, one way or another. This is the information we've been looking for. It is. We found out exactly where he's at now. <clears throat> at last, Sai Sahan has been taken to the halls of torment. Well, th there's only one question I have for you. What is that and where is it? I guess that's two. It's Cold Harbor's most nefarious prison. The Daedra in the halls of torment reach deep into the dark places of a prisoner's mind and torture them with apparitions of the things they most dread. That sounds a lot like what happened to Lyris, actually. The so similarities are remarkable. It's an effective tactic. The Daedra mock our emotional attachments and the memories that form our sense of self. Daedra have no use for such things. They are immortal. It's impossible to kill Daedra. They simply reform over time. Wow, I didn't know that. We need to rescue Sai Sahan. Can you get us to the Halls of Torment? Of course I can. I am Abnathan. He's so full of himself. I have a bit more research to do. Go back to the Harbridge and tell Varen what we've discovered. I'll meet you there once I've made the necessary preparations. Very well. Thank you. Whoa. That was cool. So... We just leave? I guess so. Get my sword out just in case. My great sword just in case someone wants to act funny. Doesn't seem like anybody will though, so... Alrighty. Hello. Okay. Perfect. I don't want to fast travel. Only because it uses up my money. How much money do I have anyways? I should probably check. I should... I probably do have enough to fast travel, but I don't like to waste money. I got 14k. Mmm... I think twice born is better, I think. Okay, where am I going? Fast traveling probably is the fastest way there though, isn't it? Yeah, let's just go, let's just fast travel. We'll go here and then just go outside. It's probably the best, and it's free now that I think about it. Free to travel to houses you own. So I guess I didn't waste money. It's a good thing about having a couple of houses laying around. The rude people, the noise, the chaos. Is it strange that I find it comfortable? No, not really. I'm so confused. All right. Varen, I'm coming. I need to talk to you about something. We discovered the location of Sai Sahan, a place called Halls of Torment, which sounds pretty disturbing, but that's what I found. We're definitely going to go on a rescue mission again. This is going to be the third rescue mission. We went once for Lyris. Uh, actually, four. Once for the Prophet, once for Lyris, once for Abner Tharn, and we're going to end up mounting a fourth rescue mission for uh, Sai Sahan. It's a lot of rescue missions. An unexpected visit. What brings you back, Vestige? So, Abner Tharn and I have discovered where they're keeping Sai Sahan. It's in this place called the Halls of Torment. At last, where can he be found? 
like like I said, a prison place in Cold Harbor called the House of, uh, the Halls of Torment. Well done. I will begin searching for a safe route to the Halls of Torment immediately. Uh, is there anything else? I was going to say that the river flows and we are slaves to its current. But I am done with riddles and metaphors. I don't know what awaits us. I'm not a prophet. I'm just a foolish old man who glimpsed the wisdom of the scrolls and survived. But can you find a path to the Halls of Torment? Uh, but you can find a path to the Halls of Torment, can you? When Tarn returns... We will combine our resources. We will find a path to these halls of torment soon enough. Okay. Cool. So we're good here. I kind of want to fix my gear really fast. So what we're going to do, actually, we're going to go to my house slash guild hall. Which, if you guys want to go join my guild, you guys are always free to do so. I'll play with anybody who wants to play that's a part of my guild. It's really the only requirement. If you guys want to play with me, just join my guild. It's not, it's not complicated or anything like that. Uh... Yeah, and you guys will be able to take advantage of everything. Here, you know what? Let's give you guys a quick tour. So this is the arena, obviously. I got some... I got that guy. I got that guy. That guy. And I want to put another big guy right here. That way we have, you know, training areas all over the place. We'll go upstairs in the back right now in a second, but... I kind of want to go this way. I keep forgetting to do so, but I, I want to buy the rest of the... um. Munda stones and put them right across right here. There should hopefully be enough and We'll be able to have all the Munda stones here That just looks absolutely insane by the way But uh, yeah, this is the area that's gonna have all the Munda stones I, I basically am gonna I just need to remember to do that and not forget because that's the problem that I have I keep forgetting to buy them and then of course I have the dot the uh, uh Outfit station here, the clothing, a blacksmith, cooking fires, all the basic stuff. Woodworking, got a transmute station, a jewelry crafting station, enchanting and alchemy station. And of course, a house guest, which I kind of want to get some more house guests and put them all, all over the place. We'll go into the house right now in a second, but there's also a throne room or a area here where we can watch stuff. We have a lava trap, which is pretty cool. It starts to spew out these fireballs, right? And then uh, the blade switch. This is probably the coolest one out of all three of them. Chop people into pieces. At some point, we'll probably have like some tournaments in the guild or whatever. Do some giveaways. And then, of course, the lightning trap, which is arguably one of the coolest ones. Altogether, it just makes an absolute... Destruction, check this out. Try fighting in that. Okay, now that they're all off, let's continue the tour a little bit. It's not very remarkable, it's like there's not a ton of stuff, but it's a cool place to hang out. In here, obviously, we have the merchant and the guild bank or the bank, period. And then upstairs, I have my room. It's nothing really here, but it's my room nonetheless. And then what else is there? Is there anything else to show around here? I guess back here, right? But there's nothing over here. This is just an area to chill, I guess. I'll probably put a table or something just to have a chill spot, you know? Actually, you know what I think? Now that I think about it, this would be a cool staging area for like tournaments. Everyone could just hang out right here, and then whenever you call their names, they can enter the arena and battle. Yeah, this place is dope. What was I gonna do? 
I wanted to come here for something, but I can't remember what I was gonna do. I don't remember. Can I talk to this person? I've little time for no. And then my merchant can't. Yes. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't think so. I was hoping that I could repair my items here. Okay. I can't remember what I was going to do, so I guess we'll continue the story. Let's go... Let's go back to Daggerfall. Because I think uh, we can get the dude to show up again. Mr. Varen. Back to the Harbridge it is. Where is the Harbridge? It is right there. So luckily we already have the quest marker on it. I don't have to put a custom one on there. So let's go ahead and go. All right. We'll get there eventually, but looks like we have a sky shard that we need to pick up. I think we need one more. Oh no, that was it. We got an extra skill point. We have five now officially. Yeah, we need to we need to do something about the skill points because I already have five skill points that I need to invest in myself probably in passives to be honest but we'll get to that point eventually I always forget how to get there is it this way it's kind of weird getting there from the other side yeah okay this is it right here all right let's go inside <laughs> 